Hello everybody. So today I just wanted to do a quick like 20 minute go-to tutorial for what I do using minimal products just kind of every day. If I want to look somewhat put together but I don't really have time to spend uh, doing a full face of makeup. Um, so yeah, I think that is about that. I have prepped my skin by putting some toner on and then some of this uh, Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. I am trying this out. I also have a rose water one that I am trying out as well, so I will let you know my thoughts on these. But it does kind of, uh, when you first apply it, have a little bit of a tackiness. So I figured that would work well as sort of a primer. So we're going to test that out. Um, yeah. So we'll give that a quick spritz. Okay. So we'll just slightly tap that in. And then I have, this is, you know what, we'll go through the products first. I have the HD High Definition Liquid Foundation from Red and Black Cosmetics. It looks like this. And then this is the e.l.f. Blendable something concealer in light beige. Then I have my L'Oreal Lash Paradise here. I have a Maybelline Master Coal liner here in Charcoal Skies. It's just a gray eyeliner. And then I also have my Age Rewind, which we may, may not use. I'm not sure yet. I don't typically have this out. I don't know. We'll see if I feel like I want a little bit more coverage or not as we go. And then I have, as always, my Cody Airspun Powder, the Butter Bronzer. I have my Super BB from Physicians Formula as well in deep. And then I have my Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighter in Golden Flower Crown as well. And unless there's something I'm forgetting, these are all the products that I'm going to be using and I will set up a timer and we'll see how we can do this. This isn't, you know, every step of the way. This is just a quick, I need to look put together sort of a look. So we're not going to worry about eyebrows. We're not going to do a whole lot of eyeshadow or too much bronzing. Uh, I typically don't even have a highlighter out, but I figure it's a quick step. It, if we have time, we'll get to that. Otherwise, I mean, it's fine. So we will get to my phone and let's see, timer. I want 20 minutes. Okay, I don't know if you'll be able to see that. The 20 minute timer. So we will go ahead and start that. Okay. So then we'll just take the foundation and just throw a couple pumps on there and literally put it on our face as fast as we can just to kind of have a base. Maybe not. 
So when I don't have a tan, this actually matches me like perfectly. So I don't know how well it is right now because I kind of have a tan, but not anything super tan. I don't know, am I even making any sense? Probably not, but there is that. Just so we kind of have a base. And then here is the e.l.f. Blend, blendable concealer in light beige. This pretty much is nothing once you blend it out. It's blendable because it blends to nothing. Like, literally. So I can just throw this wherever, but it does have kind of a dewy finish to it. So sometimes you can just throw this on your skin and blend it out with your finger. If you just kind of want a little bit of something, and I mean a little bit of something. But we added the foundation as well. Like, I think I've pretty much used most of this product and I've only used it a handful of times, if that. So then we'll just take our sponge since we have it. Otherwise, I would just use your hand and we'll just kind of blend that out that we've put that all over. It does have a slight orange tinge. Um, so be aware of that. But like coverage wise, uh, doesn't really have much of anything. So we are down to 16 minutes and 20 seconds. There, so that has just kind of evened out our complexion. It is nothing too fancy or anything like that. So there is that. Then we'll go ahead and throw some powder over it. If I'm in a hurry, I will just put it straight on here. Just kind of pat, pat, pat. Okay, so now that is set in place, it's not going to go anywhere. We'll just make sure we get the neck. Okay, and we are powdered. So, then, we can just go in with our butter bronzer. I'm just gonna take my contour angle brush here and just 
sweep it right in there. is a stripe. I uh, much prefer to layer it, make it look nice, opposed to just slapping a bunch on like this, but if you're in a hurry, you're in a hurry. But this also has a very nice sheen to it, so it looks nice. It's in the way. And then just whatever's left, you can just kind of throw on the sides of the nose just for a little something. And then we'll go over the eyes. Okay. And just to kind of give it another quick blend, we'll go over it with this. that is so then we'll just go in just take this fluffy brush here whatever we'll just throw on a little bit while we're here we are down to 11 minutes and 40 seconds so stop. I'm just like, okay, okay, let's add more, add more. And then, I'm good. So that is that. And just take a big fluffy brush. This is the uh, Super BB. And since we didn't use this on our face, I'm just going to throw it and my crease just so we can have a little bit of definition there okay. then just for shits and giggles we'll go in with the Butter bronzer as well. Just kind of Bronze around the mouth, and then just take the eyeliner and not usually that messily, but. Okay, and we'll just kind of clean it up a little. 
Okay. And we're down to eight minutes and 50 seconds. And we'll just take the Lash Paradise. And quickly put some of that on. And I can easily spend 20 minutes just doing my mascara, so There's a little clump. There we go. If you ever have problems, take the brush and just kind of wipe off the product and then try to go back through if you feel like you have enough. So that is a lot of mascara. We're down to six minutes and 38 seconds. So what I'm gonna do is take this other mascara and just try to fix that because I put on way more than I really wanted to. think that's gonna get fixed really um, if you want you can kind of just carefully take some and just kind of put it through just be careful And I mean, pretty much that's it. I guess we have some time, so we will I don't know where my other lipstick is. This is the Stay Matte Liquid Lip from Lip from Rimmel and Latte to Go. Uh, BH Cosmetics Liquid Lemon Liquid Linen in Evelyn. Maybe it might be a little bit better. Okay. Uh, 
I think that's everything. I mean, if you wanted to, you could take, since we have three minutes left, a little bit of that highlighter and just kind of brush it on your lid. I'm just going to put it right here in the center. Just for kind of a pop of sparkle right there. Just be careful. I got that mascara all over my lids. That's not cute. Um, we'll go ahead and put a little bit in the inner corner. Uh, get that little smudge off that I got. So now we've got our inner corners are highlighted. Mm. You could take some on your brow bone. Ooh. We are highlighted today. Because I don't have enough apparently, I'm going to continue to put it on my cheeks. Okay, we are highlighted like nobody's business. So, there is that. And we are down to like two minutes. How did I do this so quickly? I don't understand. Um, I guess we'll go back in. Help this uh, bronzer situation a little bit. Nose edge. I feel like I did this a lot quicker than I normally do because I'm not missing any steps. I mean, I even did highlighter, a lot of it. So, I don't know. But, you know, we're down to our last 30 seconds. Now that this has had time to kind of dry, I just take my fingers or if you have something else since I can't be bothered to go buy an eyelash curler. We're just going to push our lashes up. So that is how I do that. And our time is up. That was 20 minutes. And it is just a nice, simple 20 minute makeup. I wonder. Nope, you still can't see it. Okay. But there is that. Um, yeah, I mean, if you wanted to, you could go in with some eyeshadow, kind of do a little bit more, but I really like the simple thing like that. I think it looks really nice, and I just kind of did a little twisty thing with the top part of my hair to get it out of the way. I need to, like, re -dye my hair or something. I don't think it looks cute like this. 
Um, pretty much you can just use whatever products you have. You know, if you want to go for that more coverage foundation, uh, spend a little bit more time on that. I think that usually takes me a little bit longer and I did it pretty quickly today. I think that's why I had so much time at the end. I don't know. But um, nonetheless, we did it. I am not going to edit that part in this video because I did want to show you that it is 20 minutes. It is what it is. So that is that. Um, these are just the products I used. You don't have to have anything super fancy, whatever you have, use it. If there's a certain step that you prefer, if you have to have something in your brows, go for it. I often forget about my brows, so there's that. But yeah, this is our final look. You can see the highlight is very shiny and my eyelashes are very well coated thanks to the lash paradise and once again this is just kind of a pointless anything but that is all i have for you this week um if you wanted to put setting spray on you could um i don't feel I really needed it right now, otherwise I would have. I do have some mascara though. So do I have a stiffer brush? Let's see. No, maybe they don't want to come off. Um, I don't know. There's that. So, it fell. Um, that is it for today's video. I hope you have a great day. And if you like this video, please give it a like. I don't know. I'm just rambling at this point. Have a great day.